Hello everyone. Uh, today I am going to do a video on uh, autosport analysis using the crime data. Uh, for that, you can see we have here crime data, and I have uh, projected this data already. You can see it here in the folder. In this is the folder which includes crime name, crime ID, police station, division ID, victim ID and these are the variable or the column head present here. So with this now I am gonna start my crime data projected uh, file here and you can see it this is the data of the simple we have taken to do a hard spot analysis and you can see it there are total altogether 827 points here simply you can look at here and now what the art sport analysis will do is it take uh, your stress uh, stat value to analyze the uh, more prone or the uh, more crime zone here by taking the data stat value by taking p value and the z value or dispute analysis generally based on the two values z value means uh, that means field value or the p value means uh, probability value and it is based on the null hypothesis and here how its value is determined i will be describing later on so now i am entering into the procedure part or the tutorial part first of all you have to project your data in a utm zone of a respective zone for that you have to go to here data management tool and you can simply go to your projection and the transformation and after that you have to go to project and you have to define the necessary pattern parameter that it acts as for to enter and here you have to provide the input data set which isn't projected in input coordinate system that we have used in this input parameter coordinate coordinate and output data set or the feature class where you want to save it or in the working folder and this is the output coordinate system where in which you want to project your data after that you can simply click ok and after that now we have to uh, first of all after that we have to copy our this copy features means it will copy our file so that it wouldn't affect our original file so I am copying that you can simply do this and click ok and I am saving it in the default location which it go now you can see we have copy our file so I am gonna removing the original file here and after that I am going to integrate this so that we can do a cluster mapping for our dispute analysis it integrate will reduce the number of points taken but while doing cluster mapping is our dispute analysis is the cluster mapping based on the uh, significant of the less significant low significant value so we have to do here and for that you can choo choose the distance here generally according to your number of sample taken or the points you have uh, generally xy tolerance it will uh, integrate the value around the distance which we put here so I am going to generally integrate 
of 30 meter around value will be integrated and it will show one value to it. And you can see it here, I am clicking just OK. After that, I am going to collect event from that integrated file and call it events. And call it events. What it will do is uh, it will collect the events from the integrated value is uh, integrate reduces the point by uh, taking the overlapping points uh, nearby the distance mu bar root around 30 meter as I have assigned that distance there. So here after that you can simply go with this default one. I don't want to make any change here. And after this uh, you have to check the P or D Z value for that for your uh, analysis, analysis or the analyzing pattern. So I am gonna delimit it simply this you can see it here I am gonna delimit it spatial autocorrelation that is more than a y i index that will show you and it will generate report and it will ask us this one simply you can go with it simply and you can see the report here is it is showing minor error over here but you can see the report over here and go to this simply and you can see the report over here and this is the report you can see and here what it will show is us that is here modern index is 0 0.01 is this value is showing us that uh, uh, our data is very weak and we have very less significant value here so i am just showing the procedure how to perform it so i i am going with this value to to run the procedure so after that you can simply go with uh, analyzing the situation you can if the p value and p value is higher then we can uh, reject the null hypothesis and null hypothesis is that it will compare the two value and tell us that it is not uh, significant but and by basing on this p value as p value represent the probability values is the probability value is small and the z value is higher there is high chance to reject there is greater or the high chance to reject the um, null hypothesis and uh, there is more significant spot there it represents that um, high z value and the p value represent low z value and the high probability value represents or that the low cluster or the less significant zone so here for that i am going to use 
statistical statistic tools and here i am going to use mapping cluster as i have already mentioned about it and you can see we are going to use this and now i am going to use it in created widget poly the points file to create a widget point file so it will show the zone or the point with the high significant value you can see in the screen too now i am pinning it now you can see it here this is the output and now we are going to interpolate it and i am going with the inverse distance now i am going to use final output here and i am using zi z z score to interpolate is it represent the final output as there is high z value there is the, that zone represent the maximum crime zone and with this uh, you can put it a value from attribute that shows us that how many point are there as we have 827 value you, you can uh, show it or it is your choice and i am gonna doing it with 30 not 30 yes 30 i am going with 30 now with this you can see this is our output this is our final output showing the hotspot analysis and we have to do the uh, moran index check value and the p value and the z value which is the main part in this uh, hotspot analysis so now i am gonna tell you the output result as you can see there is i already mentioned the i want to show you the attribute table and you can see it this two column to determine our output is the high z value and the low p value represent the this uh, significant hotspot you can see and low z value and the high p value re represent cold spot and the, its uh, significance will determine according to its value range i will show you here you can see it here and this uh, at uh, this significance is at the five percent level and it is classified on the basis of this i am showing you <coughs> and here i want to tell you that this 90% uh, confident 95% con confidence and the 90% confidence this is based on this uh, z value as i have you can see from the result section too you can see result section you can see based on this value this is more significant zone 99% significant art sport and this mm, 95 and this 90 and this non -sig not significant zone random you can see it represent here represent here and this is a dispersed zone or less zone less uh, cluster zone or the less significant zone you can make it understand according to this report so this report is very much uh, important to see whether we can proceed with the hot spot analysis or the statial tool that is present in this or not 
but I am here showing only the procedure, so I have gone with that to show you. Now with this, I am going to end my video here. Thank you. Keep watching.